that you guys with all four of the guards have got it going. You know, you, Quick, Tyrese, and now Johnny. Uh, it's it's scary uh, because you know some either one of us can have a bad game and somebody else can play real good. Uh, you know, we all on, on the same page that night. Um, but you know. For the guards to be on the same page, we, uh, we're going to be real scary, and our biggest just got to come up for show. Vandy gave you all a bit of a scare in that first half, in the right. first meeting. What Now seeing him a second time, how do you approach this game coming in the uh, Actually, since that game uh, that they played us here, you know, they, they've been on a little a little roll. Um, but, you know, uh, as they going to come out, give us their best shot, uh, we just got to be prepared, stay locked in with each other. Um, you know, go out there and play them like it's any other game. Um, and just stay locked in. Did you? I seem to remember one of the players saying the first time around with Vandy, it was it was harder like, to yeah, you know yeah, really you know, because they're gonna come out because because the name on your jersey, uh, you know, they, they coached by a great coach. Um, you know, they got some some good players that that can do some good things. Uh, so you know, we we just got to go out there and try to stop that. You guys amplified because you guys are on the road. Playing in front of another crazy road environment. Say that again. So do you think that the amplified playing on the road in front of other crazy environments? Uh, like like I say uh, on any other road game, you know, every every road game is it's a, a tough environment. You know, they're gonna have a sold out crowd. Uh, we we just gotta go out there with each other, talk with each other, and we'll be good. How dangerous is any team if they start making threes? You know what I mean? I mean, who knows what's gonna happen? It, but. No, How I does mean, that impact a player's mind when the other team is hitting threes? You just can't have your head down whenever they hit. Just try, <laughs> try to keep it moving, you know, get the ball out, get it up the court. You know, just try to keep going. You know, we play against a lot of good teams. Uh, they got a lot of good shooters, and, you know, playing against us, they can hit anything. Why is that? Because you guys are very good defensively. And the numbers show that you're right, good defensively good. against the three. Uh, You know, I would say our defense is, is, is really, like, we we doing good. We just, you know, getting a lot of foul calls. I would say, uh, so it's like they they getting it from the line. Um, but you know, we playing the three very well. Uh, well, well, how so? I uh, asked him why. Yeah, why playing it so well? Uh, you yeah, know, because that's that's mainly what, what we lock on um, yeah. in the games. You know, <laughs> we <laughs> we make a team uh, put the ball on the floor more. You know, make a basketball play. It could be it could be harder for them, uh, and that's what we try to do. Make it harder, uh, and so so we can get out and get easy baskets. Master, you said how strong you still are defensively. Does it frustrate you that you make a few extra turnovers and everybody starts harping on that? Uh, not at all. I'm used to it. Uh, you know, I, I just try to go out there. If I turn the ball over, just try to get it back on defense. Uh, that, that's my only thought. Uh, you know, I, I got my teammates out there, Tyrese Quick, Nick, EJ, really everyone out there just talking to me when, when I'm not playing so good. You know, just trying to keep me in, in the game, you know, just trying to keep me focused. And, you know, I just thank them for that. But, <laughs> but you know, I, I'm always try to get on the defensive end and make the other plays easy. Yeah, Cal is always touting your defense, and I guess he's really the only one that matters anyway. Has he dialed you back during practices at all, or are you still hounding these other guys just uh, as much as you same, same, same as it, is, it always is. Uh, you know, we always competing, getting after it. You know, he want me to be aggressive in the game and, and, and practice, it, and that's what I try to do to make others better. Kim, what did you think about the atmosphere down in Tennessee? Uh, it was fun. Um, they had a great crowd, a great atmosphere. Uh, I love playing on the road, going to, into different and tough environments just to see what we're made of. And I always enjoy playing on the road, and they had a, uh, they had a great crowd. How did it feel for you to get out there? Nine rebounds, finally. Does it click in, feel like you're in the zone a little bit out there? Yeah, I just wanted to go in and do what was asked of me to defend, rebound and then just make plays I know I can make. Um, it was kind of in a tough situation with so much foul trouble, so I knew I was going to have to be relied on a little bit more. So I just went out there and just did anything I could to help us win. So rebounding was was part of it and also defending. So I really feel like I'm starting to come into my own and I'm enjoying it. How did it feel in the locker room afterwards? And then I saw you guys, how happy they were for you? I feel great. Uh, Johnny also had a great game. Um, you know, me and Johnny just talk about amongst ourselves, you know, us being roommates and stuff, being rooming on the road. We just talk about, you know, when we come in, try to bring the, the energy level up or keep it at the same energy level as the first group. Um, I feel like we did a great job of that in Tennessee. Coach Justice was saying that you, you were starting to come on and then you got sick or got a little, little <coughs> sickness. So how much did that set you back and are you 100% now? Uh, I'm not going to blame it on me being sick or anything, but I, um, I mean, 
I wasn't feeling well for a, a decent period of time, but you know, I got to fight through that and continue to do what I do what I can do on the floor. But um, I feel like I'm, I'm starting to feel a lot better, and um, I'm feel like I'm starting to get back into my groove like I was before. Same Vandy team beat LSU last week, I believe. I mean, you all talked about that about you know what to avoid in this team. Yeah, uh, we're playing a very tough league, and any any night you can be beaten. So we can't try to look past Vandy. They're they're playing really well right now. Just beat um, LSU. So we got to come in with a with a focus and a and a mindset to attack and stay aggressive, and uh, then we should do fine.